painting coconuts. All right, I'm using Winsor Newton Artisan Water Mixable Oil Paints. And here I'm using a mixture of raw umber and French ultramarine to sketch on the outlines of the coconuts. The other colors I'll be using in this painting will be titanium white, lemon yellow, alizarin crimson, and burnt sienna. This is only my third time doing an oil painting, and I'm focusing so much on working from dark to light that I completely forgot to tone the canvas. So here I'm working a little bit backwards. And now back to painting, I jump into the center of the coconut, starting with the darker tones and working in some shadows. Then I move on to just putting some base layers of brown on the coconut, starting with medium to dark browns, knowing that I'm going to just keep adding lighter and lighter layers on the lighter areas of the coconut. And I'm letting the brush strokes at the end of each stroke show because it's just going to add to the texture of the coconut. So once I get enough of the medium tones done, I just keep moving lighter and lighter, adding some highlights onto the top of the coconut. Then I go back to painting the actual inside of the coconut. The shadows are going to be a very warm gray, and the whites are going to have some yellow in them. So I start with those knowing that I will add white on top of them. Then I go around the edge of the coconut, pulling the brush strokes in towards the center, and I start realizing I'm going to use a palette knife to try and get that texture of where the coconut actually was split. I had to use a plastic palette knife because it was the only one I had small enough to do this. Now, after doing that, I lost some of the lines and where the coconut was split was a very dark edge. So I go in with a brush and I darken that and I darken some areas of the coconut. For the background, I knew that I wanted to add some color. So I add the crimson and the mixture of the blue there. But as I'm doing it, it's coming out too dark. So I end up going back in with some white and lightening the tone of it. I want some color, but I want the coconuts to stand out. The top part I want to be very light, so it's basically a white with a little bit of the yellow, maybe a touch of the brown mixed in. And then I just blend it all together just to get a nice bright background. But as I do it, I realize I'm not happy with the bottom. It's too dark. So I end up blending it all together, and I think that ends up working better. I added a little bit more white, and then just smoothed out the colors, blending them, and it lightened the whole thing. And I think that works better. Then using a small brush, or a rigger brush, I go in and I just put in all the little textures that the coconut surface has. You have to be careful to clean your brush in between doing these because it does pick up other colors. Finally, I touch up some dark contrast and then add some white highlights to the top of the coconut and it's done. You can support my channel by subscribing so YouTube will share my videos with more people. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you ring that bell, you'll be notified every time I post a video. Thank you for watching.